there are three separate pathways to target proteins to the inner mitochondrial membrane. Before discussing about path A, let us discuss about the receptors, channels and the pre-protein involved in path A. A pre-protein having an N-terminal matrix targeting sequence and a stop transfer sequence is present in the cytosol. The outer membrane of mitochondrion has TOM20 and TOM22 import receptor. The outer membrane of mitochondrion has also a TOM40 general import core. The inner membrane of mitochondrion has TEAM44 protein and TEAM23 and TEAM17 channel. In path A, the N-terminal targeting sequence of the pre-protein is recognized by TOM20 and TOM22 import receptor. The pre-protein is then transferred through the TOM40 general import pore to the intermembrane space. From the intermembrane space, the pre-protein is translocated through TEAM23 and TEAM17 translocation complex to the mitochondrial matrix. The hydrophobic stop transfer sequence present in the pre-protein blocks the translocation of the C terminus across the inner membrane. As a result, the matrix targeting sequence is exposed into mitochondrial matrix. The HSC70 present in the mitochondrial matrix then binds to the pre-protein and cleaves the matrix targeting sequence. As a result, a cleaved matrix targeting sequence and a membrane-anchored intermediate protein is formed. The membrane-anchored intermediate protein is then transferred laterally into the bilayer of inner membrane as type 1 integral membrane proteins are incorporated into the ER membrane. A cytochrome oxidase subunit called COX-VA protein is transported by path A. Before discussing about the path B, let us discuss about the receptors, channels and pre-protein involved in path B. A pre-protein having an N-terminal matrix targeting sequence and a hydrophobic OXA1 targeting sequence is present in the cytosol. The outer membrane of mitochondrion has TOM22 and TOM20 import receptor. The outer membrane of mitochondrion has also a TOM40 general import pore. The inner membrane of mitochondrion has TEAM44 protein, TEAM23, TEAM17 channel and OXA1 protein. In path B, the N-terminal targeting sequence of the pre-protein is recognized by TOM20 and TOM22 import receptor. The pre-protein is then transferred through the TOM40 general import pore to the intermembrane space. From the intermembrane space, the pre-protein is then translocated through TEAM23, TEAM17 translocation complex to the mitochondrial matrix. During this translocation, the HSC70 present in the mitochondrial matrix then binds to the pre-protein and cleaves the matrix targeting sequence. As a result, an intermediate protein and a cleaved matrix targeting sequence is formed. The intermediate protein then interacts with OXA1 protein and perhaps with other intermembrane proteins present in the inner membrane of mitochondrion. After this interaction, the intermediate protein is inserted into inner membrane of mitochondrion. ATP synthase subunit 9 
is transported by path B. Now some important points. OXA1 is related to a bacterial protein involved in inserting some inner membrane proteins in bacteria. This relatedness suggests that OXA1 may have descended from the translocation machinery in the endosymbiotic bacterium that eventually become the mitochondrion. Proteins forming the inner membrane channels in the mitochondria are not related to the proteins in bacterial translocons. OXA1 participates in the inner membrane insertion of proteins like subunit 2 of cytochrome oxidase. Before discussing about path C, let us discuss about the receptors, channels and proteins involved in path C. A protein having multiple internal targeting sequences is present in the cytosol. The outer membrane of mitochondrion has an import receptor composed of outer membrane proteins TOM70 and TOM22 and a general import pore TOM40. Two proteins TIM9 and TIM10 are present in the intermembrane space. The inner membrane of mitochondrion has translocation channel having proteins like TIM22 and TIM54. In path C, first of all, the internal targeting sequences of the cytosolic protein are recognized by TOM70 and TOM22 import receptor. The protein is then transferred through the TOM40 general import pore to the intermembrane space. From the intermembrane space, the protein is then transferred to a translocation channel having proteins like TIM22 and TIM54. The multimeric complex of TIM9 and TIM10 showing chaperone activity bind to the hydrophobic regions of the imported protein. Due to this binding, the formation of insoluble aggregates in the aqueous environment of intermembrane space is prevented. Thereby, TIM9 and TIM10 guide the imported protein from TOM40 to TIM22, TIM54 complex. TIM22, TIM54 complex causes the incorporation of the multiple hydrophobic segments of imported protein into the inner membrane of mitochondrion. As a result, an assembled protein is formed in the inner membrane of mitochondrion. This assembled protein has six membrane spanning domains. The ADP ATP antipotor protein is transported by path C. Please like, subscribe, and share.